Hello, I hope you're sitting comfortably and ready for story time today. And maybe there might be something about me that gives you a little clue as to what today's story is going to be. Well, let me tell you. Today's story is Not in That Dress, Princess. Mm -hmm. Written by Wendy Meadow, illustrated by Cindy Bean, and it's with thanks to Otterberry Books that we're reading it to you today. Or that I'm reading it to you today, actually. So, shall we find out? What it isn't that a princess can't do in her dress. Hmm, interesting idea, isn't it? Not in that dress, princess. Once there was a girl called Bess who hated being princess. It's quite sad, isn't it? Here's Bess with her dress. But oh dear, she doesn't like being princess. I like being princess. Can you tell? For the queen, Gloriana Stephanus, always told her not in that dress. Can I climb trees? princess would ask. Not in that dress. Can I have chips for tea? Not in that dress. Can I feed the pigs? I'll let you into a secret here. Pigs are my favourite animals. Try on wigs. Do some jigs. Collect twigs. Eat some figs. Not in that dress. Here we are, here's all the things that the princess would like to do and is being told that she can't do. Poor princess. Bad luck, laughed Prince Moore and Prince Less. You must stay inside with governess. It's so unfair, stomped the princess. I want to have fun and make mess. But a princess must always impress. So for the last time, not in that dress. You can't stop me, said the princess. I'm off to have fun and make a mess. You can imagine her sticking her tongue out. <laughs> Here she is, running off in her dress to have fun. So no, 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 to everyone else. This put the poor queen under stress. There are things we do not do in a dress. Come back, snapped the cross governess. Just watched me, replied the princess. There she is, rushing off on her hobby horse. I can splash in a fountain in my dress. I can do tricky counting in my dress. I can fix a broken socket. I can launch a little rocket. I can skip up a mountain in my dress. I'm impressed. I don't think I could do that wearing a dress or not. Come back, called Prince Moore and Prince Lass. Just watch me, replied the princess. I can ride a bike in my dress. I can catch a wriggly pike, that's a type of fish in my dress. I can build a tall house. I can spot a black grouse. Do you know what a grouse is? A grouse is a bird. Here's the grouse. I can go on a hike in my dress. Come back, shouted Queen Stephaness. Just watch me, replied the princess. I can talk to a lizard in my dress. I can ski through a blizzard in my dress. I can stargaze with a puffin. I can eat a chocolate muffin. Yum, yum. Making me feel hungry now. Look, there's the chocolate muffins. Mm, you're feeling hungry too. I can dance with this wizard in my dress. Isn't that wonderful? Dancing there with the wizard. Isn't that bright and colourful? 
can you do? cried more and less. Just watch me, beamed the princess. I can go on safari in my dress. I can eat calamari in my dress. There she is, barbecuing her calamari. I can brush a lion's mane. That's very brave. I can fly an aeroplane. I can drive this Ferrari in my dress. There she is in her Ferrari. <laughs> the queen whispered to the governess. Well, she's eaten calamari and she's gone on safari. There's no finer way to impress. The queen clapped and said, let's tell the press. There's nothing you can't do in a dress. Mummy, asked Prince Moore and Prince Less. Can we be just like the princess? Yeah. She's riding a unicycle. And there they are. They're all putting on a dress because they all want to be like the princess. Not in that dress, princess. I'm not so sure. Well, I hope you enjoyed story time again today. And I hope you come back again for some more next week.